At Samsung's latest unpacked event, many fans were expecting a surprise reveal of their long-rumored Trifold smartphone, often referred to as the Galaxy G Fold. But surprisingly, the device didn't even get a mention. It left people wondering, was it delayed, cancelled, or just not ready? However, once the event wrapped up, Samsung quietly began dropping hints and bits of information about the phone, confirming that it very much exists and is still in the pipeline. Interestingly, the first glimpse of the Trifold came not through a flashy launch, but within Samsung's own software. One UI 8 revealed what looked like a Z Fold 7, only with an extra screen tucked in. This leak set off speculation, which was later confirmed when Samsung CEO, in an interview with the Korea Times, admitted they were planning to launch a trifold device sometime in the last quarter of 2024. While the name Galaxy G Fold or G4 has been floating around, he clarified that branding hasn't been finalized yet. For now, the company's energy is focused on fine-tuning the design and improving the overall user experience. Adding to the intrigue, another Samsung executive, speaking anonymously to Android Authority, revealed that the device isn't just a prototype, it's production-ready. But Samsung seems to be carefully weighing whether there's enough market demand for this new kind of foldable phone before going all in. Meanwhile, public reaction to the idea of a trifold phone has been very encouraging. Polls on YouTube and social media show strong interest in the concept, with many people excited about a phone that unfolds into a proper tablet. Still, one major concern stands out, the price. At nearly $3,000 for a first-generation device, it's a steep investment and that might hold some buyers back. Thanks to a report from the Courier Times, we also have a clearer picture of what to expect spec-wise. The Galaxy G Fold will reportedly feature a 6.5-inch outer display that unfolds into a 10-inch tablet powered by the Snapdragon 8 Elite chip. For cameras, we're looking at a 200-megapixel main sensor along with a 10-megapixel 3x telephoto, a 12-megapixel ultra-wide, and a 10-megapixel selfie camera. Price-wise, it could launch at roughly $2,900 globally, it may push close to $3,000. However, if production scales efficiently, the price might eventually drop to around $2,500. In terms of design, Samsung appears to be benchmarking against competitors like Tecno, which already showed off a trifold phone. Early expectations suggest that Samsung's version could be just as slim as the Z Fold 6, showing how much the company prioritizes thin, elegant form factors even for more complex designs. What sets the trifold apart is how it solves the tablet compromise issue that still plagues today's bifold devices. When folded, it functions like a regular phone, but once you unfold it, you get a full 10-inch display with a 4x3 aspect ratio, ideal for watching videos, reading, or playing tablet-optimized games. It could genuinely replace the need for a separate tablet. Of course, no design is without its trade-offs. In this case, battery life could take a hit, with the expected capacity being 5,500 mAh less, likely a necessary sacrifice to keep the device thin and pocketable. If you are interested in Samsung's foldables, don't forget to subscribe to us. And for more thoughts on Samsung's bold foldable future, stick around, we've got plenty more to talk about. See you in the next video.